Hello, we are now going to look at how to use the new feature of transcription in the Word uh, document of uh, Microsoft uh, 365. So log into your OneDrive account as shown on the top here. Once you're in the account, your account you log in, you're ready to create a new document. Let's create a new Word document. Once you get your Word document going, you will see all the various icons. So this is not the word that is on your desktop, but this is Word document on the cloud, on your OneDrive live account. Okay, here you see the icon dictate. You clicked on the dictate. It asks for a transcription. You can use a transcription. Therefore, if you have the file on you, where an audio file of a transcription that you have done, your, uh, you want to do, put the file. So I have already, uh, recorded an audio file which I'm now going to upload and it is on my uh, document file there's the recording I'm going to open it it's a test and you can see now that the file is being uploaded so this audio file as it's being uploaded is automatically being transcribed using artificial intelligence based on the cloud uh, um, data so it's a uh, reasonably accurate you can even use uh, two speakers and it will be able to identify the two different conversation and it will transcribe ideally it is best that you have a LAN connection to allow for a faster speed of upload this transcriptions uh, ability of the web based onedrive.live.com uh, of those who own a Microsoft 365 subscription account is excellent for doing qualitative research when you, if you have recorded a digital file of the focus group or interview and this can then be uploaded for automatic transcription. As you can see, the uploading to OneDrive is almost complete now. What you will have is on the right hand pane now the various speakers and the comments. Here there's only one speaker, but it is automatically uh, put in as different speakers. I can add all to the document. And here you are. You have the transcribed document. We can now compare this with the recording. So I'm going to click the recording here. Play the recording. The main qualities of improvement in function following pan plexus reconstruction with the use of selective nerve transfer is for the assisted living of the individual. Trying to evaluate the outcomes and function based on objective testing with a current available instruments of functional assessment do not produce a true reflection of the picture and the perception and experience of the patients involved. Yeah. So you can see that as the uh, audio file goes, it keeps highlighting the various components of the transcript. So you could look at this here, edit it if necessary, and then you are ready to add all to the document here. You've got a pretty good 100% uh, transcription. I hope you find that helpful. Thank you and goodbye.